Good morning. It's a pretty chill day today. I don't have any classes, so I'm taking it easy and slow, making myself a matcha as per usual. Here we go. I decided to go to ballet this morning because I like dancing. Sometimes I need to remind myself that because it can feel like a chore, but I am dancing by choice, so it is quite fun. I really like this class, so I try to go at least once a week. And um, today I was breaking in some new shoes. I came home and my boyfriend made breakfast. I decided to clean and then I finally got started with my day. Okay, I've mostly finished tidying my room. It's still kind of messy, but I'm finally gonna work on my main task of the day, which is finishing all the steps of pre-production for my short film. Let's do this. Okay, I just spent the past hour or so working on my short film. I wanted to try using Scrintle, which is kind of like a mind mapping website that is designed to help creative people organize their thoughts and I'm honestly really pleased with like how it turned out. The main things that I wanted to focus on today were character studies or like analyzing my characters and diving deeper so when I guide my actors I have like a very clear understanding of who I want them to embody. My main character is May. I like use some photos that I think like represent my character. I got all these from Pinterest. This one, this one, and this one. May links to Sam. Sam looks like this. Or like this is like the vibes of Sam. Sam also really likes art. They are besties. And they also like argue a lot, which is why I have like this image of like devil and angel. I really like how Scrintle like has this thing where they're both connected. And you can like see both of these notes like at the same time. And then underneath I have pre-production. And I'm not gonna go into the logistics of pre-production mostly because I still want to keep like the shot list and like the line script to myself at least until I'm done filming everything but in terms of like organizing it I am so glad that I'm done with all of the pre-production things so I have a line script and a shot list which are interconnected as you can see with this arrow and the line script and shot list also connect with the schedule and then the budget. And then I also broke down the schedule into these two. So I'm hoping to do production on these days. Actually, if we're gonna do that, let's realize that maybe this would be fun to like move it down. And then I'll add another text that is production. Okay, cool. So, yes, I have pre-production here, and the schedule goes down to production. Yeah, I'm very excited. I also want to give a huge shout out to Scrintle for sponsoring this video. Like, finishing all the steps of pre-production has really been, like, so crucial for my sanity because now I feel so much better and like so much more prepared and so much more organized and it really helps that I'm able to organize all of these things in one place. For the purpose of this project, this was super helpful and I think it could be helpful for a lot of people too. You can get 10% off the Scrintle Personal Pro plan using the code LING10. Thank you Scrintle for sponsoring this video. Completed everything on my to-do list and I feel so freaking good like I can just I could just like take over the world now now what I want to do is like film a little outfit reel so let's do that <laughs> behind the scenes of me filming this this is um wait hold on no okay this is my setup hello um this camera is like running out of memory and battery, so I'll be switching to the other one, but yay! Okay, kind of mess, but whatever. Let's go.
Okay, next up is this turtleneck. Okay, wait. Oh, I was like, I was like, where's phone? I need to find the rest of this information because I remember things, but I don't remember my most worn accessory. What is my most worn? Oh, honestly, oh. Okay. My most worn shoes. For these. It's so hot. It's like fully spring now. And here I am doing the most. Okay, this is my actual outfit of the day. Cardigan. Levi's that I recently got. Big fan. This is my first time trying this like over the shoulder cardigan situation. And honestly, yes. This would be my bag going to Central Park and reading. This is what is in my bag. I'm reading The Sympathizer and then I have some essential items. Weather has been super beautiful, so my favorite activity is going to Central Park and reading. Vibes are immaculate. I'm reading The Sympathizer, which is also Subtle Asian Book Club's book of the month. I'm really enjoying it so far, so I would highly recommend that you join us in our read. I feel like I haven't been reading as much this month or honestly since school started, and so I'm really trying to prioritize reading for pleasure and going to the park and reading is the perfect way to do it. Then my boyfriend and I went to dinner and I was reading on the train as well. We went to this Mexican vegan spot that I'm trying for the first time and it was honestly so good. But the highlight of my night was truly going to the Metrograph and watching an anime Wong film. I've been waiting to watch her movies for so long and it was such a treat getting to watch this and also so excited to listen to the little discussion in, in celebration for the new biography. I'm so looking forward to reading this book and watching more of her films because I know they're going to be so good and it was such a treat and like I love it so much. As a final reminder, you can use my code for Scrintle and I will also leave all the details in the description. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day and thank you so much for watching. Bye!